Today on Blog Success Journal, how to choose good tags for your blog posts. All right, choosing good tags, why does that matter? You know what, it matters a lot because that's how search engines, well, that is one of the many ways that search engines can find and send people to your stuff. So you wanna get ranked for stuff, make sure you use good tags. Just think of it that way. It's a simple thing to do, just get in the habit. Tags field is where you provide, and it's just a simple explanation. That tags field in WordPress, you're writing your post, and there's a field that says tags. Always fill that in. That's where you get to provide loosely related keywords for your blog posts so readers and search engines know the topic you're touching on at a glance, okay? In short, it's a short list of topics that your blog post touches on. It's very important to have. Here's how to do it. Yeah, and like Dan was saying at the beginning, just our personal experience on all of our blogs, is that when you start getting ranked in Google and the other search engines, it's your category pages and your tag pages that get ranked first, and then individual articles start getting ranked. So they're very important. Now, when should you pick tags? We say before you ever write your post, okay? No, write the headline, know what it's gonna be about, and then do some keyword research and pick the top tags for that post. Now, having said that, if you're really stuck and you have a really inspired idea, I'm gonna write this article, well, you can always go back and pick your tags after you've written the article, but you wanna make sure that you include those keyworded tags in your post afterwards. Yeah, absolutely. Now, how the heck do you pick these tags? Like Jennifer said, how do you pick them? Process is very similar, really identical to researching keywords. You're looking for tags with a lot of existing traffic, keywords with a lot of existing traffic, right? You wanna be writing about stuff that people actually search for. If one guy in Alaska searches for once a year, bad topic. Uh, often the tags and keyword phrases are the same, but tags allow you to expand a bit. Again, you can go into loosely related, not to one topic it's mainly about. So your blog post should target one to two keyword phrases primarily, right? In the headline and the body text, if you wanna rank for it. And then you can select related tags and put those in the tag field. They can be the same as the keywords or loosely related. Yeah, now how many tags should you pick? You know, do you just go all out and think of every keyword that's possibly related to your article? We say no, okay? Pick the top three to five, that's plenty and it's easy for your readers to know what your blog is about. If you start having thousands and thousands of tags, it just gets confusing. So pick the top three to five for that article. Don't be a tag oh, spammer. Oh, and also search engines. If you start putting too many tags in there, then they just start to get search engine spamming, okay? So be selective. Don't be a tag spammer. <laughs> so do you pick your tags before or after writing your post? Let us know.